<clears throat> I just want to ask you a question, Eileen. Did you know that the average American most likely has swamp ass? That's when you don't wash your anus out, or when you take a shower or a bath. You don't wash your asshole like, like, you, like you have. I just had diarrhea, gastritis. Oh, well, that's so great. So don't think it's me. Yeah? Well, we do think it's you. No, what I mean is it's very important and hygienic. I'm sorry. Oh, I'm to, sorry. to wash the anus. I just had diarrhea. Not to yeah. travel. Well, no more. Everybody, go ahead. You had what? <laughs> diarrhea. Diarrhea. Gastritis. Well, there's two kinds of diarrhea. Diarrhea of the mouth and di real diarrhea. Well, she's got both. No, you have, you have both. My poor mom had a, had a bout of that. I gave her a modium. I, uh, you should have seen the cleanup job I had last night. Are you in the, serious? In the middle of the night. Oh, my God. I gave, you know what it is? That damn soluble fiber my sister wanted me to give her. I think it's called de dextrin or something. Or I says, L Lisa, no more. Let her get her fiber from grapes, bananas, and oatmeal. I'm not giving her this damn crap anymore because she was, it was a mess. Gastritis is diarrhea. I've had it since no, I it's not. Gastritis is, is, is a it discomfort. Is, but, but it, it causes but, diarrhea. Gastritis causes diarrhea. I had it since I was 14. Uh, I was going to gast the Gastroenteritis is when you have a bug, you know, an a, a intestinal virus. I think you have diarrhea virus. of the mouth. Diarrhea is a symptom. It's not. It's not the actual affliction. It's uh, like gastro. You get. No. Then you have irritable bowel syndrome. Oh, her bowels are irritable. I know that. That's that's like no matter what you eat, it goes. Where oh where are you tonight? Why? I listen to you. I know. Well, that's where the diarrhea of the mouth comes. Of the mouth. Okay, let me ask you. Let me tell you a true story. I, let me try. Not that she's ever gonna like pause, but let me tell you a true story. Today I got a, a bill from Holy Name Hospital in Tina. The uh, the anesthesiologist uh, over over two thousand five hundred dollars was not enough for the anesthesiologist. I got a bill for sixty dollars and one cent. Oh, they have to have that one cent, Eileen. No, I'm serious. I'm being dead serious. You always had these cents. I don't understand. One that. cent. Now, after 2,500, the surgeon got 3,000. So that means the anesthesiologist bill was almost as much as the surgeon. But one cent. Holy name. Just they, they gotta get. I know. I'd make her pay. The one cent. But it's like I mean, they he already got 2,500 bucks. Pennies on Eileen. You want another 60 bucks? Diarrhea Eileen. <laughs> now, what I have to do, I have to call and see if United Health, if they build United Healthcare. What's your nickname? Irritable Bowel Syndrome. I.B. Eileen. <laughs> I.B. Eileen. Where, oh, where you heard me. are you? Don't you go with that what you say thing again. I need to borrow one. Yeah, so. no. And why did you leave me here alone? Anyway, your story is unbelievable. PSC and G, what is that called? Uh, Ripoff New Jersey oh, Electric yeah, Company. Yeah, everybody hates them. Uh, you, 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 they turn your power off. You pay the bu the bill in full, and lo and behold, they never turn it I back still on. Can't get power. And they say they don't. They didn't have access to it. And my my uh, mate is just showed me. He says I left it open all night. They're, like, they're lying. He said they had access to come in and turn it off, didn't they? But the point is they're paid in full. Uh -huh. So what's what's their yeah, excuse? Two days now without a shower, nothing. I'm gonna have a swamp bass. And then it's gonna be 90 degrees. And it's gonna be contagious. I'm gonna give it to you. Now, swamp bass, speaking of swamp bass, the average person can use a wash rag, but I have a special shower head from Italy called Cyroflex. And it has a detachable hose. It is for people with low water pressure. In other words, it's high volume. It's a high volume shower head. For, for, for it's like your diarrhea. Yeah, which high is volume. very high volume. Yeah, I can say. So what you do you is... You do look thinner. Now, did you go to... Wait, I'm sorry. I'm sorry. I'm, okay, I'm, I'm, sorry. Sorry. I don't, I'm sorry. Did you go to a doctor about your broken nose? I just went today. Not and? a nose specialist, but I am Jay. He 
he says he says I don't have to go to no specialist. And he no didn't specialist. Say, he didn't say it was broken. He didn't say it was a fracture. You know. Well, then nobody tells you anything, Eileen. What's going then why on? Then why did Hackensack University he didn't say Medical Center? Oh, my God, you help Nobody me. says it is or it isn't broken. So, something. It was, it was broken and <laughs> So what did he say? It's not broken or it is? He didn't say anything was wrong with that. What did he say? It's Wednesday madness. He, he, he just said that I no. signed it. No. Oh, Thursday. It's Thursday. Yes, that I signed it. Thursday madness. And, it's Thursday and Thursday madness. But he didn't come right out and say, don't worry, it's not broken. I'm so mad I even forgot what day it was. Oh, I mean, too. But. He didn't say anything. Then why did the guy in the emergency room at Hackensack University Medical Center could not diagnose your, your, your affliction, your injury? Who knows? Who knows? Who knows? Get it? Who knows? <laughs> yeah, but I mean, you've been two people. Nobody's... Why are people telling you anything? What's, what's going well, on Well, I hope here? you learn a very valuable he was lesson. He me a hard time anyhow. He was complaining. I said, oh, she probably drove everybody crazy in the ER. Yeah. Hey, Eileen, really, you, you always have stories. Listen, What's going on? Eileen, I hope you learn a very valuable lesson. I came doctors, I mean, uh, two doctors came no, you probably and wouldn't shut up. And said that my brother died. I hate two doctors came down and said your brother died. Did he yes, die? White coats. I hate going to that. White coats? When? Like just now? No, 15 years ago. Or did he die? He did no. die, yeah. Your brother, I thought he was still alive. You told me he's... What does that have to do with you being in the ER? I don't know. I'm getting confused. Why does, what does that have to do with you being in the ER with an injury? No, but my other brother, I hate seeing doctors. And why did you, why did you look down for your, for your spring water when you were driving the car? It was not thinking, you know? Too many Yeah, obviously. You know? He keeps saying, you know, Eileen, please oh, stop God, that. Help me. I swear to God, I'm bringing whiskey next time. I'm bringing whiskey next time. And he time. has to take medicine, and, and the medicine is making him act crazy, you know? No, I don't know, and why did you get off on this guy I'm, now? I'm going to need medicine soon. Why did you get off on that? Because it's making me act crazy. Who is? It's making me act crazy since he's acting so crazy. What is wrong with you all? Listen, listen, the, the Cyroflex hose would blast your anus out and you will never have swamp passing like ever again. Listen, when you drive, concentrate on driving from now on. Look straight ahead. Yeah, Don't her guy. Why, why oh, is he that... down there helping him? Why is he down there helping him? He, he, he's he... so sick right now all these tumors. I said, why aren't you down there helping him? Well, why didn't he visit her? Well, he won't let you go down there. Ah. Yeah. Uh, What's he say? Well, wait a minute. I got a new... to be down there in the beginning. Wait, I didn't go down there in the beginning, so now we don't want anybody going down there. The special amulets I keep in my wallet, I made a, a pendulum out of it. Did you get a new one? Oh, yes, I did. Hold on. Where did you get the new one from? This is used in voodoo and uh, hoodoo and, um, and exorcist. exorcist. The, the Catholic priest uses in actual exorcisms. It's the, the medallion of Saint Benedict. Yes, and it's and it's to give me answers about Eileen. Watch, here we go. <laughs> okay, and I use fishing line monofilament. Okay, hold on. Let me let me let me. <clears throat> okay, our friend here, and I use that term loosely, Eileen. Is this, is this so-called fiancé of hers ever going to keep his promise to her? To marry you when he turns 60 and he's what, 63 now? Marry me, Says no, he's not going to marry you. What promise you mean? Say to marry you, man. Marriage. Marry you. Marriage. No, no. I can't believe that thing. No, Why not? no, he's no, he's not going to marry. So, Why not? so, uh, do you feel that this man the other, the other that man lives in South Jersey is leading Eileen on this whole time? Yesterday, you said he was leading you on. So he was Saying yes, he has been leading you on this whole time, Eileen. He's leading you on. We ask about the amulet. Is Eileen afraid of you? Oh, is Eileen afraid of you, Mr. Amulet? I 
Why did you big yes? You're not supposed to believe in these false things. You're supposed to believe in God. No, you're not. No, you're not. Hey, this this fishing no, line, no, this, this fishing line is great. No, it's not that good. No, you better off with No, because I learned how to tie it. I I no, use I use a squirt. It's going towards nothing. Yeah, but I I couldn't get it through the are hole. Any, are any of the world's religions correct or right? Are any of the world's religions? Correct or right? You mean like organized religion? Any, any, any. No, no, no. You. Any. Jesus died for our sins, you know. Are any of the world's religions correct or right? All no. right, it's saying no. Is religion? Is religion? Is religion a total load of bullshit? William H. Morris. No, no, no. I didn't. I'm not no. saying this. Is religion a total load? Of is religion a total load of, of bullshit? Yes. Yeah. Well, I, I, I think I, I agree with Jesse Ventura. Organized religion is for weak-minded people. Is there a God? Well, is there a God? Is there a God? No, is there a God? Is yeah. there a God? As man know or thinks there is. Yes. Let me try. Well, you know, you know, you know, it, it depends on what you mean by God. There's no, there's no old man with a long white beard well, sitting on the clock. Yeah, yeah. He's in a different form. You know. Does God truly exist? Big no. Did God create man? There is a God. God puts His presence down. You, on you're confusing it. Let him, let him do his thing. I forgot what I said. Did God create man? You said. Did God create man? Did man create God? Hmm. Is our friend at McDonald's, Eileen, ignorant about her belief in a God? No. Yes. <laughs> that thing is so, so far God. <laughs> Does is Eileen afraid of you? Yeah, she she making up stupid excuses because she's she's scared of believing in you. He's a prophet. Does Eileen change her stories? Oh, does Eileen change her stories all the time deliberately? Does Eileen change her stories all the time? All of the time deliberately. Yes. Wow. These are not small swings. No, no, they're That's not, not child's play. It's not child's play. No, it's not to be played with because it is a no. true oracle. So. Okay. Why do we have a God? That, Nobody said, they just said you do not have a God. Your God does not exist. No, he does not. These are so historically documented. I researched them. I ordered it from Texas, uh, a company from Texas. I you got it. aliens where they dissect everything. God does not exist. Oh. Then, why, then why are people dying and going to heaven? What? Because of aliens in different dimensions. Nobody said it's a god, Irene. Why do you think it's a god that's doing this? Why am I wearing this? This because you believe, Listen, you, you're easily swayed. You believe in false faith. You know, really you, you does Eileen believe in false faith? Oh, oh! I accomplished this by doing some, the, these people. Oh, where are you going now? Where, where the hell are you going? Oh, does Eileen believe in a false faith? Huh. Is Eileen incredibly ignorant with her beliefs? There you go. 
Wow. Diarrhea. Diarrhea. Yeah, so what I what I did was I did left over right, right over left, well, which is square nine. No, and I did it several times. Well, that's good. And that's why, it, you know, that's the only way I could do it. Well, you should ask a question, I think, instead of telling me about not making Yeah, no, I'm just saying the only way I could see the hole, it wasn't this hole that was a problem, it was so much that hole. Yes. So the floss. You know what? You're probably right. I could. I bet I could have used wax dental floss. I think. Go in quick. Give me. I don't care about the knots. Come on. No, man. it's interesting. No, it's not. You know, there's a book of knots by written by sailors. Know, but You're not interested in sailors? No. If you want to talk to her about it, I don't. What? I don't want to talk about knots. Go ahead. Ask knots. Questions. All right. Let me think. Oh. Uh, PSC and G Energy Company. Are, are they? deliberately jerking William H. Morrow around about turning on his his power yes well that's not fair do is it a glitch in the office since he paid the bill in full no no it's not a glitch it's not a glitch there somebody deliberately is busting your so someone is deliberately at PSE and G busting William Morrow's balls with the power. It says yes. Go clockwise. Yes. Somebody's busting your cluyuns. I know. I get better swing. Well, it is. It is going clockwise. See, look. Look. It is. All right, your swings are better. Your this is better. Your that is better. I'm bracing it. I don't know what else to tell you. You know, I got to try it. Yeah. Um. Let me ask you something frivolous, because we already asked serious. Oh God, look at it. it's raining. It's raining heavy. Um. Do most Americans really do have swamp ass? No, don't, don't make any jokes. Oh, all right. No, um, no. Does Eileen have swamp ass? No. Make a joke. Uh, will, 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 will we really see almost 100 degrees this weekend? That's all you want to ask? At, at the moment, I, I can't. Kind of a weak question. Oh, 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 okay, here we go. It's based on what I, what Michael Moore said. On Twitter, Michael Moore said that you cannot be illegal in a stolen land. Was he referring to the fact that Native America, the plight of Native Americans, uh, and that you know? Wait, Jimmy, how, you're asking me like three seconds here. Now. All right, all right. What's your quick question? This Mike, was question? Michael Moore referring to the plight of Native Americans? Michael Moore's recent stating, a statement, was he referring to the plight of Native, Native American Indians? Oh my God, look what someone did. They put their license plate Yep. Yeah, no one is illegal in stolen land. A very wise statement at that. Rip? See the big swing? Because Hollywood and the media, they always mention the Holocaust. The Holocaust. What do, you, what do you want to know? About your they always mention the Holocaust, but never about indi ha, 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 indigenous people. What's that? Ha, 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 what's that? Uh, I don't know. I've never heard of that thing before. Well, so what's that mean? Well, what about the crystal? You heard of that? I think we're going to get. I never heard the crystal neither. Well, and he has his own at home. He has he has everything. He's got amulets. This is a simple question. It's an amulet. It's called an amulet. Does what? Eileen, our friend Eileen at McDonald's, is, 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 does she have bats in her belt? Does I, our friend Eileen at McDonald's have an awful lot to learn? It's called in mysticism. It's called the pendulum. Right into a big yes. Oh, you need an education, <laughs> and you better start with preventing swamp ass. Does Eileen have any clue whatsoever as to what's going on? Oh boy. Look at that. Look, look at the swing. Look at that. 
in two, two powers. Yeah, big that's one, this one. Yeah, I know they were. Well, you you have intuitive. My mom used to do the Ouija board by herself, which is very dangerous because you can get an attack. You can get an attachment. A demon can attach itself to you. Ever going to get married to this guy? She refers to as my guy. Think those kids can make any more noise back there? No. The answer is no. No long. No long-term commitment from this guy, the my guy. No. Like Marge. Well, it's been six years. Clockwise is a yes. Positive response. And, and no kind of clockwise is a negative response. I know. I mean, six years and no commitment. That's how we know. See? Yeah. Counterclockwise, meaning the opposite of clockwise. Okay. Did Arlene's brother ever steal money from her? No. How do you know? Maybe you spent nobody it. Nobody else would have stolen it. But they you have no proof, do you? Now that I got money in my apartment, it's not getting stolen. Yeah, but you, but you have no proof. Maybe she spent it and doesn't. I, I didn't spend it. It was, it was only him that took it. Nobody else is stealing it. You didn't it see him though. take it, did you? Nobody else is stealing it now, though. I know. Is Eileen imagining that her brother took it, stole her money? I'm no. Not is Eileen imagining that her brother stole her money? Is Eileen imagining that her brother stole her money? No, well, you don't know. You don't have proof. I got proof. It's not missing now that the box has changed. It, it, it's, it's deciding. Let me try. Say no, though. Say no, Jimmy, right? No. No, it's deciding when it goes back and forth. It's It's... It's in a pro process. Don't say no when Jimmy does Jimmy. Hey, ooh, ooh, ooh. Diarrhea, diarrhea of the mouth. You gotta be calm down, man. Relax. It's probably what happened in the ER. You would like to think I'm imagining it, but is I don't Arlene, have a brain. Is Arlene imagining that her brother stole her money? They don't like to say Arlene's imagining things to make I look stupid, but she's a college graduate. Yes. Imagine it. You'd like to say it I like your swings. Like they're big. They're positive. They're, they're, well, I mean, no, they're they're, they're obvious. No they're, yeah, they're no. They're they back don't. And forth oh, we could swing it this way. We could swing it that way. But I know too, and God knows too. We yes, can't fool Eileen, God. Eileen is very afraid of you, isn't she? We can't fool God. When you all reach heaven, you'll find out too, and you'll say, "Screw that thing." Well, you can't fool God when He doesn't exist. God exists. No, he does not. When you go to heaven, you'll find out. Oh, really? What, what about a polygraph test? <laughs> polygraph test will prove it too. You take him to court. Does God truly exist? Has nothing to do with Paris, by the way. Polygraph test. Look, Jimmy. Look at that. Da -da -da -da. Boom, boom. Is Arlene simply believing in something that is supernatural? Yes. Oh, I have a good question. A good one. Is life on Earth, as far as human life, an extraterrestrial experiment? Oh, I told you that. I already asked him. Yeah. So you're saying, are we from this planet or were we put here? Yeah. Okay, the human species, the human race, we're not from this planet, are we? We were put here by an alien race, weren't we? Was it the Anunnaki? And the Hopi Indians believed in the sky gods too. Doesn't matter. Was, no, but is Jimmy? Is part of Jimmy Anunnaki? Is a good part of me, Anunnaki. No, no, it was 1997. Yes. Yeah, I could, I could picture you uh, 
related to the Anunnaki. Yeah, the, I know the, um, and it's not just one, the, the Anunnaki, the Sumerians, are from the middle, uh, Babylon, well, the Middle East. But the Hopis, oh, oh, hold on. Yeah, but the Hopi Indians also talked about visitors by, by so called sky well, let's gods. Wait, let's not talk about. Here we go. Oh, shit, I forgot what I was going to say. Well, it, it all started with the Anunnaki, uh, which were mentioned by the Sumerians in the Middle East. No, um, many, many, many beyond them. They're mentioned in two, so many. All over the world. Uh, the Anunnaki are mentioned, yeah. The, May the Mayans mentioned it, yeah. Aztecs, Incas. Incas, right. Oh boy. Um, about your descendant, you were going to ask a question maybe about your your ancestry? Sure, I just went blank. I can't remember what it was. Yeah, because PSC and G aggravated you so much. Did God create man? Did man? Did man create God? Well, maybe that's due to your intuitive uh, abilities that could be connected to your Anunnaki ancestry. Possible. Very possible. Yeah. But, it, but yeah, in all seriousness, um, the wax dental floss, is, that's what I use to repair my, uh, my bamboo wind chimes. I use wax dental floss. Because the only, the only one... Oh my God! Be afraid of this. Shouldn't fear this. No, they left. You're hearing the after effects of their sound. The residual energy. You're hearing the residual energy. Not really here, I'm not really here. They are not really here, I leave. And if the kids are adults, yeah. Well, no, I didn't know. How come the kids even in my area talk talk loudly too? Uh, yeah. But not girls. girls. You know? You know? You know? Oh, here. Let me put this. Thank God. See, girls, girl, girls, girls are not usually loud and obnoxious. They just care about how much money a man has. How much money you make? A man. Make and have. Is Eileen hard of hearing? Yes. <laughs> God. I'm going to play tiny. Does Eileen? Does I, does, shut up for a moment. Does Eileen say you know far too much? Yes, yes. <laughs> you know? Oh, the ER. The emergency room of Hackensack University Medical Center. Did they. Did, did Eileen drive them nuts? In the emergency room at Hackensack Hospital. A couple of days ago when Eileen went in there, did she drive them nuts? <laughs> That's, pro that's probably why he didn't give her a diagnosis. That's why, no, it's saying you're definitely, you drove. No, you must have rubbed him. You must have rubbed the doctor the wrong way. So different. I don't think you're telling us the truth. What else do you know? Um... You, you, you know, you notice, uh, you notice how how Trump's buddies are trying to discredit Mueller, Mueller's investigation today. Oh, they always have it. Well, no, I don't know today because I've heard the news. Oh, that's days. right. Yeah, yeah. There's a there's a hearing. What? Oh, that. Oh, who cares? I can't. Yeah, I am. Can you pick it up for me? Because I can't bend down. 
It's a straw. It's a piece of straw. Oh, I thought for sure, because I can't bend over. It's a piece of straw paper. I, I then meaningless. It, it, yeah, but I don't want to make a mess like everybody else does. Yeah. I don't like oh no, we're stuff. we're always very clean here. So what do you want to know? Thursday madness. Oh man. Oh, it's slowing down the rain. Good. Um, let's see. Oh, will. Robert, his name is Robert Mueller, right? Would Robert Mueller's investigation f be finalized? Well, sure, will be at some time, Jimmy. That's common sense. Well, I don't know how long it would go. You didn't say how long. You said, will it be finalized? Of course it will, sometime. Uh, we know it will be finalized, but when, we don't know. Would Robert Mueller's investigation come to an end in the near future? Investigation into what? Donald Trump and, and, and the Russian involvement. Robert Mueller was his investigation into Donald Trump and his dealings, possible dealings with the Russians come to an end fairly soon. Even the switch would still work on the TV. It only it, it cuts out it cuts out from the Yes, Will Stormy Will Stormy Daniels lawyer who's helping Mueller Aid Robert Mullis. Will Stormy Daniels' lawyer aid Robert Mueller? You no, know, because they really haven't even talked. There's no reason for them to. And they just went right to the nose. Yeah, because when they ask, See, so when they ask right Avenatti, he doesn't yeah. he doesn't answer. It doesn't mean anything. It's yeah. a, they're two separate cases, Russia. And paying for a they're, they're, to to they're totally yeah. two different so there cases. There you go. It said no. Yeah. There's no tie in. So, again, it was right. Alright. You mean you can't just, like, bombard somebody with a whole bunch of issues if they're guilty? Well, it's different cases, different yeah. lawyers, different things. Yeah. Well, they only, different situations. they only did that in the Salem witch hunt, I guess. Is our so-called Supreme Court a total load of bull in many aspects? Yeah, yeah, yeah. Why are they in for life? Uh, that, that's, that's like the Pope. Well, that's the point. The point is they're human beings. All humans are fallible. To think they're so supreme that everything is the final word. I don't buy that. We, we talk about that here every morning. It's bullshit. Yeah, that word supreme in Supreme, supreme Court. Court. Please. Hey, this is the same Supreme Court that said it's okay to burn the American flag. So I don't like a lot of your decisions. Okay, what do you want to ask? Anything? That's, well, that was part of the First Amendment, burning the American flag. Uh-huh, and what happened? How many states banded together and, and put in new laws to, to fight that? They put in new laws. If you beat somebody up burning an American flag, it's only a $25 misdemeanor. That's it? That's it. Which is why you don't see people burning the flags. They're scared to death. They said, uh-oh, the states got together. They're going to get us for this. Because the other states said, this is fucking bullshit. Oh, and you know what's, you know what's the biggest bullshit of all? When, when the right-wing conservatives want to involve their cultist religion with making laws. They they want to in, interject their religion. Scientology is a big, super huge crock of crock of shit cult, isn't it? Saying yes, right? Yeah. So so is evangelicals. Yeah. Even evangelical Christianity is is that. A bullshit cult. Does I really believe in God? Well, let me, you know. Because she doesn't have a clue as to what's going on. Yes. Strong is. Yeah. Let me ask my question. Even right wing evangelicals, is it actually a cult? Yes. Go back, it's okay to repeat. 
Are any of the world's religions correct or right? Yeah, it's not really going into a clockwise. It's going into an undecided. Is any of the world's religions... Are any of them. Are any of the world's religions correct? Or right. Or right. Are you busting my balls? Oh, no. See? No, see. Well, all that part. Let me ask no, you're not busting my balls, but you know what? Don't, don't ever yeah, but uh, I get, I take things personally, you know. Who doesn't, but we don't have control. Yeah. Are any of the world's religions correct or right? The swing's nice for him. Is, that, is it not? Look, not. no. No. No, no, I'm just, it started up hard again. Yeah. No. Is religion a total load of bullshit? Oh, boy. Look. Yeah, it's saying yes. But it's saying yes in a nice clockwise swing. It's a big swing. Positive. <clears throat> Does I does Eileen send away? Does Eileen have what's called blind faith? Look how there was no hesitation right into it. Goes right into it. Yep. What's blind faith mean anyhow? You, you have no proof, and you just believe in God, and you have no proof ba that there is. Based on perception, not yeah. on proven what fact. What you've been taught, or whatever, it doesn't yeah. mean squat. You know, really it's just based on perception. Yeah, that's it. Don't mean squat. Yeah. You know, this is the problem. This uh, people pay attention too much to what you perceive, and that should never be. That should never you hold any weight. In the supernatural. That's enough questions. Huh? That's enough questions. I think we did good. I get good swings. Yeah, overall, we, you know, yes, good question. So, so Eileen, will you do your part in the prevention of swamp ass in America? That's that's not an answer. I gotta take I take pills to prevent it, but I didn't take. Pills are not the answer. Mm -hmm. Pills are not the answer. Is actually physically washing a certain area. Yeah. You're meaning Uranus, not the planet Uranus, but Uranus. That's your favorite planet, though. That's where they're gonna banish every all, all every everyone has swamp ass, like bogeyman. What was that? The March of the Wooden Soldiers. They banished them to Bogeyland. You know, Laurel and Hardy. Oh, oh my, that's a joke. Bogeyland. I'm not gonna ask a silly thing. Like but you wanted to ask those other silly ones before, and I said no. Don't play with it. As soon as I had diarrhea, I had to rush out for a doctor appointment. Wait a minute. I had diarrhea, and then you, I had to go to a doctor do you, appointment and come here. Do you, when I you, went to the doctor appointment. I came here. So you had you probably had anxiety. I'm gonna get my burger. Now, yeah. I want, I no, I'll follow you. You you probably have anxiety, and that caused the diarrhea because you knew you were gonna have a doctor's appointment. Let me ask you a question. Do you have a modium in the house? Yeah, okay. Talk so, I think you can talk sense into her? It's not going to happen. No. You have a modium in the house. I take pills for diarrhea. I got them in my pocketbook. A modium is, um, well, he doesn't have a pocketbook. It's over the counter. Hi, hi, hi. I'm done. I'm done. Thursday Madness, progressive discussions, super, te super tech edition. You can't, you can't get any, talk any sense to Eileen. Good night, Eileen. This has been a Mega Life 21 production.